okay let's find uh, slope and deflection now slope at the support so a b and deflection under the point load c l con by using unit load method so it is also by unit load method okay so to find this what you need to do to find the deflection i need to apply unit load hat here to find the slope at a i need to apply unit load at a so first let's write the beam once again and to find the slope i need to apply unit moment here for this beam but uh, i'll be taking here a c b l by 2 l by 2 because for p i have split it the region so same concept i'll be using it i'm not changing anything here okay so next one i had to find the deflection under p so i need to apply unit load at here l by 2 l by 2 okay so a b c now we know what we know we know uh, delta is equal to integration m m1 by e i dx so we'll have a table of form let's solve it with a table of form only portion so portion will be taking now the portion will change here ac and cb okay so then limit l by 2 0 to l by 2 0 to l by 2 then ei there is no change in ei so ei okay then so all the things are over limit here over here so i need to write m bending moment due to the applied load m so what will happen is you will be taking a section at a distance x from a and x from b okay so that is the true region so m so what will happen here for the region ac so load here is how much is a p by 2 so total symmetrical one so it's a p by 2 so what is the answer is p by 2 into x sagging so it is a sagging moment uh, sagging moment so i'll be taking as a positive symmetrical one so it is p by 2 x Okay, this is what is m then uh, let's find small m uh, now here m1 so this is what is the m1 unit moment so this is what is m2 so for my convenience i'm writing it so m1 is rot slope and m2 is uh, a deflection okay so m1 because of that moment so we need to find the reactions here so what is the reaction because of this unit load total span is l so find the reactions so that's what is very very important so here take moment at uh, b is equal to zero so when you take moment at b is equal to zero so this force will be acting downward so that is what is we'll get it so this is l by l and we'll get one by l upward force and one by l okay because take moment at b is equal to zero so it is one uh, same plus v yeah, since if it is the same direction into l is equal to zero that's equation you will get it then uh, when you simplify so downward direction so one by l so in the sum of the form of vertical force is equal to zero so you will get one by l in the upward action this is downward this is upward okay so this is 0 0.5 so this is 0 0.5 similarly so just get the reactions first then we can easily solve it so m1 so what's the value of m1 here so the ticker here is 1 by l uh, into x for the region a to c 1 by l into x so plus 1 because i need to have a unit moment here plus 1 so i cannot leave that so we need to take care of that so plus 1 next one uh, let's go for the region one more region so what is the answer 1 by l into x because that is a sagging moment and this is a hogging moment is hogging this is a sagging
or m2 so because of m2 what i'll get is uh, 0.5 x same here 0.5 x so this is what i have here completed now the total forces now find slope at a theta a is equal to integration 0 to l uh, m m1 by ei dx so what is that indicate theta a is equal to integration 0 to l by 2 uh, m so capital m is p by uh, 2 ei into x into m1 so m1 is 1 minus x by l uh, into dx plus integration 0 to l by 2 uh, so it is same px by 2 ei into x by l into dx so let's simplify this so theta a is equal to okay this is p l square by 24 ea if you integrate this you will get p l square by 24 ea and uh, next region if i do it p l square by 48 ei so if we solve this 1 by 48 plus 1 by 24 so we will get p square by 16 ei okay now find uh, deflection under the load so that is what is the delta c uh, so deflection deflection at c so what is that one delta c delta c is equal to integration 0 to l so it is the m m2 by ei dx so we will be writing m, m2 by ei dx so so we need to take care of this so delta c is equal to uh, integration 0 to l by 2 uh, m so the value of m is so there is no p by 2 x so it is uh, p by 2 x into so m small m2 is a 0.5 x so 0.5 x is 1 by x by 2 into dx okay then plus integration same thing 0 to l by 2 so it is p by 2 ei uh, x into x by 2 into dx so you can see here since it's a symmetrical one it is i can write here two times so delta c is equal to two times integration 0 to l by 2 so p into x square by 2 ei dx so 2 to get cancelled so when okay so so when you solve this into 2 so this is what i'll be getting it uh, everywhere 2 by 2 is there okay now when we integrate it what we'll get so p l cube by 48 so this is what is the answer we'll get it uh, p l cube by 48 